Hey guys, it's Stephanie, and today I'm going to show you conditional formatting in Google Sheets. So here I have a task list of all the items I would like to start and complete um, by these different dates. As you can see here, I've actually already gone ahead and applied conditional formatting. The conditional formatting is please format all dates before today. And today is March 14th, 2018. So you'll see that March 1st, 2018 and September 5th, 2017 have been formatted. So I'm going to show you how to do the same kind of formatting in the end date column. So go ahead and select the cells that you would like formatted. We're going to go over to format. We're going to select conditional formatting. And you'll see here, this is the range of cells that I've selected that it will apply formatting according to the formula or the conditions you've set up. So this is where you're going to apply the conditions. Right now it says cell is not empty, meaning it's going to format any cell that's not empty. If I were to highlight these cells, these cells would not be filled in with the green background color. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna change it to match the start date formatting. We're gonna say date is before today. And as you can see, it's gone and highlighted all the dates before today, March 14th, and uh, July 1st, 2018 is the only one not highlighted. Um, here, further, you can actually change the kind of formatting. These are preset formats, but you can do your own custom formatting. You can bold and italicize however you want to do it. So that concludes uh, conditional formatting. However, there are many things you can do with it, um, including an option of writing your own custom formula. Please leave questions in the comments section or uh, make your own suggestions. Thank you for watching.